We save you money on Wednesdays with What's the Sense. We are on location today with Tamara, and we're doing something a little unique yeah, a little because different. what's the sense of being in a consignment shop, right? Right. Consignment is huge. Now, our area is a little limited. Yes. But other areas, other states, it is massive. I, it, when I worked in Colorado, it was everywhere. Clothes, furniture, everything. But this is a cool little shop. My favorite little shop in town. Mm -hmm. um, it's the shops too, and right. there's so many cool things in here. You could come down here and spend hours, and come back the next day and spend hours. And I actually, first time I came in, um, got myself. I fell in love with the desk mm -hmm. that was Sophia by Orks. Ooh, okay. And it just put me on a whole new tangent with her and following her. I didn't know she was a Hazelton native, mm -hmm. and. Um, there's just some really cool stuff in here. So let's take a look around. Yes, and plus, we want to say we're here at the shop too for the next four weeks, giving you ideas on how you can save money, how you can support local, and you know, sometimes you don't want to buy a unique item because you don't really know where to stick it, what to do with it. But this area has a lot of culture, a lot of history, and we're proud of our background and our heritage. Absolutely. This is a place that you need to stop in. It's right on Broad Street. It's a block from Jimmy's Hot Dogs. Hello, <laughs> excuse to go to Jimmy's, right? And they have some really, really neat items. So. Throughout the weeks, we're going to be talking about specific items, but really, if someone doesn't know what a consignment shop is, what is it, and what specifically do they sell here as far as a consignment item? Right. Consignment is um, something that you have that you really don't want to just get rid of it. You can sell it. Okay. And um, Carmine had said she has over 500 consigners, mm -hmm. and, that's, and they're very loyal. So you could put a piece of furniture in here, okay. like something like these chairs, and sell it right I mean and she does take a portion of it but she's selling it for you and this whole just environment as we walk around you're gonna see um, instead of just giving it away not knowing what to do with it there's so many people that would this would fit or uh, you'll have some like memory right things I walked around here and had huge things like oh my gosh I remember this I remember um, just some a lot of Hazelton and right they had a um, Atlas, okay. the, the powder company. You'll see okay. when you walk over there. Yeah, it it was like my uncle worked there. I was like, wow, that's really cool. So it brings they, back yeah, good memories from good all memories. different generations. But, so. And she does have layaway here. So mm -hmm. if you walk in here and you do see something you like, and you, mm, can I buy that? Lay it away, um, and just bring your stuff in. Buy here, buy local. But be, before you go out and buy. Somewhere else, come in here because I'm just, even if you have to refinish it, if it's not something you like, mm -hmm. it's still pretty unique. All right. So again, you have that uh, tax money maybe coming back in on your um, income tax money. If you're the lucky one that does have money coming in, yeah. you could spend it on yourself. Come here and shop local, buy local. Again, every Wednesday we're talking about what's the sense of shopping at a consignment place like The Shop 2. They have two locations, and we have more information for you next week on What's the Sense.